So here we are uh, with the revision of the chapter Deep Water by William Douglas, a revision. The theme uh, of this chapter, the author William Douglas talks about his fear of water and how he finally overcame it. He narrates an autobiographical incident that occurred when he was 10 or 11 years old and almost drowned in the YMCA swimming pool. As a result, he developed a fear of water, which he was able to conquer after several years by sheer determination. Now, just justification of the title, this extract is appropriately entitled Deep Water. The author recounts his fear of swimming following an incident in which he had been swept away by a wave. Another incident which further aggravated his fear was when a bully, uh, that is what is the 18 years old boy who was there in the chapter, when a bully pushed him into the deep side of a swimming pool and he nearly drowned. <clears throat> but slowly he overcomes his fear through determination and strong will. He even took the services of an instructor. He swam in different pools and lakes to overcome his fear. The title also signifies that the author's fear was deep-rooted one. In short, the title is appropriate. <clears throat> now the message which is given by this uh, chapter, it is not necessary for every chapter to have some message, but this chapter gives us a message. The story Deep Waters tells us how the writer overcame his fear of water and learned swimming through sheer determination and willpower. He had developed a terror of water since childhood. William Douglas was able to overcome his fear by sheer determination. The message conveyed by this story is that it is not death but the fear of death that creates terror in our mind. So that fear needs to be shaken off. Also, any fears can be conquered if we try hard enough. <clears throat>